We are in Hyper-V on a Windows Server 2012, and I'm going to show you how to add hard drive space to a virtual machine. So first, make sure the virtual machine is turned off, and then you can double-click on it. And from there, go on File, Settings. So if you try to do this with the virtual machine running, then everything here will be grayed out, and you cannot make any changes. So what we're going to do is expand a hard drive. We've got our hard drive right here. And it's just not big enough for our needs, so we're going to make it larger. So what we do is we click on Edit, and we click Next, and we choose Expand. And we choose Next, and right now it's 141 gigabytes. We're going to change that to 175. Click Next, and then click Finish. Now we'll click OK. We have to start the server up, and we still have one more step we have to take in order to get the server to recognize the extra space. So we'll get this thing running, and then we will go into computer management and make the change there. We are now logged into the virtual machine. Let's go ahead and open up Server Manager. Let's go over to Tools on the right-hand side and open up computer management. You can also do this in the server manager itself, but it makes a little more sense, a little easier to see in computer management, which is the more traditional view of changing hard drives. So now we'll click on storage and disk management. And we'll see the extra 35 gigabytes over on the right-hand side. So the server sees it, but it doesn't know what to do with it yet. So what we'll do is we'll click on the, our C drive, right-click on it, and choose Extend Volume. Choose Next. It sees the extra 35 gigabytes. Go ahead and choose those. That's the default. And Finish. Now we see our C partition is 175 gigs, and that partition off to the right has now been swallowed up by the C drive.